What's been the focus that you guys have talked about through preparation at Clemson leading into this matchup? Just enjoying the moment. That's been Coach's biggest message is just enjoy it. You know, it's uh, it's going to be an awesome moment. It's going to be a huge game, but just really enjoy, you know, every part of it, especially for these guys that are going to be gone after this year and just really enjoying every second of it. There's been so much made about the two quarterbacks playing in this game and that you guys are both gamers. How do you perceive the matchup? Yeah, you know, I, I was just saying before, I think it's, you know, people make it more about me and Joe, but it's really, you know, Clemson versus LSU. You know, it's a team, you know, the best team's going to win. And, and that's the biggest thing is obviously me and him are going to have to play well to, to make an impact. And obviously as a quarterback, you're going to make an impact. So it's important to play well. But I think the biggest thing is just trusting the guys around you and, and the best team's going to win. You know, you got to rely on those other 10 guys out there. You guys had to battle back from down 16 against Ohio State. What did you learn from that game that you hope will show up against LSU? Just that we, you know, we got that belief in us that, you know, no matter how much we're down by, we can always, you know, we can always, we're always still in it. So that's the biggest thing. But also that we, we didn't execute well and we need to play a little bit better for sure to, to beat this really good LSU team. And lastly, give me the routine that you have the night before a game that gets you ready for a national championship. You've been there before yeah. and won one. Well, we have a really long test that as quarterbacks have to do. So that takes, me and Chase do that together. So that takes a little bit. But uh, me and him just hang out. We'll talk about the game and just kind of what we expect. And then um, we'll, we'll kind of pull up my laptop. We'll watch a little bit of film together. So that's, that's something that we do. How does preparing for this national championship compare to a season ago as a freshman? I think it's different um, just because it's a different team. And uh, not only us, but we're playing a, a, a really different team in LSU. But it's similar. Just, I mean, the moment is still really special. And it's, you know, it's a national championship. It's still just as big a deal. And uh, but really just, I think, preparing. I've tried to do it the same way I did last year, but just a little bit more detail. That's the biggest thing. Right. Thanks for your time, Trevor. Yeah, for sure. Thank you. Be back in your home state and preparing for a national championship. Uh, it's been really great, a great experience. And uh, just very thankful. Just want to thank God for the opportunity we have. And I mean, it just has been a mind blowing experience so far. Uh, got off the plane, went straight to Drago's. And I mean, just got, had to get that home, cook food in me. So I mean, just, just very thankful for the opportunity we have. You're coming off a matchup where you had three touchdowns and you were the game breaker. How do you translate that into a national championship game? Uh, just just uh, knowing that last week's success don't translate over into the next week's success. So, but I mean, that, my team is going to definitely count on me to play the best four cards that I can and be able to impact the game any way that I can. So I mean, I'm just ready to go out there and play free and just play for those guys. No extra emotions on this one? I, I mean, it's, it's emotion, but you got to realize that emotions aren't going to win you the game. But I'm definitely going to be fired up to play, definitely going to be playing from emotion, but have to just make sure that translates the right way into my game. All right. Thanks, Travis. All right, thank you. What's up? Thank you so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. Don't forget to download the ESPN app. And if you want more premium content, which you do, make sure that you subscribe to ESPN+. Plus. See you soon.